Hello everyone, and welcome back to my Resident Evil 7 playthrough. This time we're going to try the Not a Hero DLC, which is apparently some Chris Redfield story. I don't think I've read anything about it other than this nonsense here, which says almost nothing. So let's check it out. It's got a menu of its own, apparently. Is it ready? Can we begin? Man, I can't help it, man. We've got work to do. Is that Lucas? It's an umbrella helicopter. Chris, did we lose him? No, no. Ethan Winters has been secured. He's alive and well, considering. And Lucas Baker? Right now, he's our only link to the connections. He's next on my list. He doesn't look or sound like Chris. I'm very confused. Umbrella OS. All right, I'm in the mine. Signal strong. You're coming through loud and clear, Chris. We didn't get much from the first unit before we lost contact, but apparently Lucas turned the mine into his own personal hideout. How many men did we lose? Three of our best. Their last transmission was near a lab that should be just ahead. I'm going to need you to check it out. Got it. Oh, hey, this gun. What else does he have? Grenades? And is this a shotgun? Or is this a rifle? Inventory. Looks like a rifle. No, it's a shotgun. Okay. Whoa. Settle down. Nice. Magazine fed. I don't know why it needs a red dot sight. <laughs> it's got a breaching attachment on the barrel. Kind of weird looking. It's got a gas tube. What does it have hanging off of the gas tube? It looks like uh, some kind of loop for you to hook a strap to. Why would that come off of the gas tube? That doesn't make sense. That's well, coming off of the gas port or the gas block that attaches to the gas tube. Very strange shotgun. I mean, I guess that would be a fairly stable part of the gun, but I still wouldn't want to attach anything to it. It gets pretty hot. <laughs> Chris, do you have a flashlight? It's a little dark over there. I wonder if they lost to the voice actor that did Chris. Or if maybe it's just different audio filtering settings and that's why he sounds different. Oops. Right, maybe I should use the shotgun. You know, I'm about to need to shoot something, aren't I? Okay, I was not expecting that. But I guess I can't complain. That's one way to deconstruct the threat. All right, um, what is in what slot? Okay, I need to swap the grenade and the gun. Okay, that's a hell of a lot better. 
What do we have down here? Can't tell. I can't see it. Nothing in here. That is where we came from. Why, hello there, sir. Now that is a shotgun. None of this four rounds nonsense. The lab is just ahead. Any idea what Lucas is up to down here? We're still analyzing the data, but it looks like he's been running experiments with an E-type butamycete. Let's hope those men oh, have become a part of those experiments. This guy doesn't sound anything like Chris. I don't know, maybe they were just trying to rebrand Chris. Was there anything wrong with the original Chris? I guess I know people who don't like him. But not everybody I know who plays Resident Evil dislikes Chris, so... Do we get to pick up ammo? We get to pick up grenades. Be nice if we had a grenade button instead of having them in our, you know, scroll wheel nonsense. That's right, we just push on the door or we double tap. Son, you look like you had a bad day. Get out of here. Leave me. It's too late. We're both walking out of here. Is that a bomb on his throat? What? That's not gonna happen. Oh, I wouldn't do that if I were you. <laughs> now, you can try and take that off all you want, but I'd advise against. My hand might slip and... Uh... Lucas, stop! Oh! Ah! Oops. <laughs> that was close enough it would have hurt Chris, too. And I'll bounce your head off the ceiling. Oh, and the same goes for your little soldier brains, too. Adios. Mood chachos. <laughs> Fuck. I'm picking up airborne spores. It's the E-type mutamycete. Your mask will switch automatically to rebreather mode. Keep an eye on your oxygen tank to be safe. So basically, I can't stay in here very long. Well, it doesn't look like there's any reason to stay in here. Looks like you're clear of any contamination. You should head back and get that bomb on your arm deactivated. There's no time. I don't want to give that asshole a head start. Understood. Just be careful. Close, please. Okay, so I don't have much time in here. What the hell kind of oxygen tank doesn't hold more than 30 seconds worth of air? So what, we never actually killed Lucas? Time to run. That's a bit of a long run, though. Don't forget about your oxygen supply. Is it gonna recharge out here? Yes. Okay. I wasn't sure what that button actually did. It looked like it brought an elevator. I didn't know if it would get here in time. I'm gonna have to be careful with my shotgun shells because I'm not finding ammo anywhere. Seriously, it closed again? All right. Um, am I gonna die before this goes down? Chris, 
Once we finished analyzing the data, we intercepted from Lucas. It's like we thought. The son of a bitch has been sending status reports on Evie to the connections. Find him and bring him in. We can't let this happen again. Are you sure you just don't want to recruit him? <sighs> Chris, we've been over this. Maybe the BSAA is convinced. If they weren't, I wouldn't be here. But working with Umbrella is going to take some getting used to on my part. I know it must be difficult, and to tell the truth, a lot of our members have been with us since even before we reincorporated as a PMC. About all that's left now is the name. Let's just focus on the mission, and maybe we can continue this conversation when you get back. Okay? Sure. Whatever. So are they trying to convince Chris that they're just a private military company now, and not a biotech research firm anymore? Please tell me there's ammo down here somewhere. Okay, I have a feeling I'll be going that way eventually. Well, closes behind me. Nice. Great. Giant clown face with a big red nose. And the red nose is probably a button I can press. And it will probably do something unpleasant. Don't ask me why I'm going this way. I honestly have no clue. I guess the fact that I saw something down here made me think this might be a good direction to go. Uh-oh. You okay in there? Redfield? Don't worry. I'm gonna find a key to this thing and get you out of there. Yeah, Lucas is gonna blow his head off as soon as we do. How did all these heavily armed guys end up in this situation. I mean, I know Lucas is like some kind of super mutated something or other, but still, if Ethan could handle him, I'm sure these guys could have too. Where the hell am I? Key, okay. Oh boy. This is not going well. So, grenade. And that should be problem solved. You gotta be kidding. Wait a minute. And gun ammo. Is it only three rounds? Seriously? What do they think comes in a box of ammo? Apparently only three rounds. Can I stick the cog on there and see if that does anything? Oh shoot, I need a lever or a... Is that uh, shotgun ammo? I think it was. Okay. About the only thing I can think to do is blow them up, too. Funny how one of them fell down so much quicker. Oh, it's because the other two aren't falling down. And almost immediately, more of them pop out. Excuse you. Look, I need in here. Can't have you morons popping up all over the place. Trying to stop me. Flashbangs, I think. Did that actually put a dent in them? Oh, wait. Not sure. Seems to have put a dent in them. This ought to do it. 
Of course. Be fast, Chris. Uh, that's very large. Can we make it eat a grenade, I hope? Or better yet, drive something into it? Please tell me what I'm looking at. I have no idea. Something new. Ouch. Exercise extreme caution. I think it's too late for extreme caution. Okay, it has a high rate of regeneration. Um, what do I do to it then? I don't think we're going to survive much longer. I could leave. Oh, I don't want to go that way. Not while he's there. I kind of want to look at whatever's over there, but uh, whatever that monster is is in the way. Can he not see me right now? Am I being quiet enough to avoid him? Kind of looks like it. Hmm. It's that Joker face again. Or what I'm assuming is a Joker face. Unfortunately, I can't get out that way. And my friend is right around the corner. Ah, crap. I need to start blocking. I can. I don't know, can I just use another grenade on him and get away again? He doesn't seem to like to come down here, though. Does he? Oh, no. There he is. You just stay right down there, buddy. There's no need for you to be worried about me at all. It's not coming this way, which is a plus. I don't know what to do about him, though. I guess run away. That's about all I could do. All right, I assume this is the key for his door. Appears to have been. Everything's all right now. That's just what he wants you to think. I'm just a bait, and you fell for it. What? If you could talk, then why didn't you say something? Ah, oh, shit. Take the filter on my mask. Hurry. But you'll die! Yeah, I'm, I'm dead either way. <sighs> He's right, Chris. Just watch and learn. Lucas! No! I guess we have to hope that he doesn't destroy the filter. Filter up, please. Hurry up, Chris. I'm sorry. I don't know what the hell you were waiting for. Lucas. Chris never was the brightest of uh, agents, was he? Agents, police officers, whatever the hell he is.
Well, I guess that negates a game mechanic. Until they decide to take the filter away from us. Or pull a metro on us and make the filter uh, not permanent. But I can't wait to get my hands on that asshole. Just remember we need him alive, Chris. Yeah, yeah. Can I store that key? I don't have the key. Letter with umbrella's goals. Doesn't even look like I can read it. A briefing document? Is there any point in looking at these? Nope. Okay. This they could have done was make them readable. Okay, so that's for this Joker key that I don't have yet. What's up here? Bird cages. I haven't found any coins yet. Stabilizer. Reloading speed increases indefinitely. Steroids. I'll assume max health again. Looks like that's what that says. <clears throat> yes, I would like to save my game. Thank you. All right, well, we'll try this door. It was that old game show where you had like three or four doors you could pick from. Is that the price is right? And isn't that still on TV? I wouldn't know, I don't watch game shows. Chris. All right, I still do not have this Joker key, but it's pretty obvious I'm going to need it. Well, it's probably a good thing I went the other way first. I'm going to keep wandering through contaminated zones. Is that a bomb? It's a battery. The other side may have a key card on it. If I remember right, Lucas's key card nonsense had batteries. What are these? Some kind of mine? This must be where they kept all the dead bodies. Open to Great. suggestions. You'll need ramrods to stop it from regenerating lost tissue. You're going to have to fall back. <sighs> so probably we'll just wasted that grenade then. All right, so we're not going this way yet either. Right next door. So let's see, we've been behind the reddish door. Guess this one, blue gray door. There may have been a way up there. I didn't check up there. What the hell just happened? Okay. We appear to be missing something important. But something important right now might be a key. Is there anything down here that I didn't see earlier? Let's go around the other way. Oh, nice ammo. Is 
not seeing any more ammo or other stuff to pick up. Oh wait, handgun ammo. Definitely need that. Oh, it doesn't seem to be anywhere else to go. Am I supposed to destroy that uh, monster? It was regenerating. I couldn't kill it. I need one of these keys, but I'm not finding it. There's a grenade. Can't open either of those. Well, nothing to do but go fight that monster and see if it drops a key. I mean, unless the key was in that uh, in that room with the door that was locked. It's kind of hard to see in here, though. I certainly didn't see anything that looked like a key. Well, let's go face the monster again. I don't recall whatever the lady on the radio said being particularly helpful with this thing. And I imagine I'm probably going to die in there. How much health do I have? I have one. Lovely. I also have flashbangs. Do you think those would help? Let's try them. <coughs> Probably not flashbangs. Affected. Okay. Is extremely resilient. Ammo isn't going to cut it. I'm open to suggestions. You'll need ramrods to stop it from regenerating lost tissue. You're going to have to fall back. What do you mean fall back? There, there's nowhere to fall back to. Well, I mean, there's the room I've already been in, but where am I supposed to get this weapon to fight it with? Okay, so I got the filter. Where else am I supposed to be able to go? I need night vision for that other place. I've only found three doors. I can only go through this one. Unless there's some way in there. I certainly don't see a way in. Am I going to have to look this up on the wiki already? Okay, there really is nothing in here. You didn't have anything else? No? Lucas didn't have anything stashed in here. Doesn't look like it. That's what, the third time I've looked so far? I've got to be missing something, but I have no idea what it is. Maybe if I backtrack a little bit. Oh, 
No, I'm not opening that with <laughs> any of this nonsense. Hmm. Yeah, I'm only seeing three doors. So what was it that killed me when I went through here? So why does Chris not automatically have night vision? I mean, he looks like he was equipped by a military of some sort, so shouldn't he have night vision? Apparently I didn't see that earlier. I've the better the handgun ammo is respawning. Well, I can't backtrack. And I can't proceed through any one of the doors. As far as I can tell. I'm very confused right now. There really was nothing to do up here. What was the point of this if there's nowhere to go? Is that a giant drilling thing? And if it is, then why is it not attached to anything? Well, I have no idea whatsoever what to do or where to go. And it's been about a half an hour, so I think I'm going to call this here. So thanks for watching, everyone, and have a nice day.